Environmental leaders hope Earth Day will make you think about how you're treating our planet. Lexi Johnson is live with that message this morning. Hi, Lexi. Good morning, Dan and Carrie. So Utahns are urged to do their part to protect the air, land, and water. When it comes to air quality, Salt Lake Metro now ranks as the eighth most polluted U.S. city compared to 11th last year. The Utah Department of Environmental Quality says driving and wildfires are major factors. They also hope people in Utah will reduce litter and recycle more to help cut down on physical pollution, plus keep the water clean. We make uh, choices on both our usage of water, and that's important during a drought, but also how we impact our, our streams, you know, making sure that we keep our vehicles from, from dripping oil, making sure that we don't uh, drive on areas that have ground cover or vegetation and uh, tear up that vegetation so that then that silt can, can enter our streams and rivers. Um, so all those things are, are important aspects of what we do on a daily basis. In light of that drought, Salt Lake County Mayor Jenny Wilson is planning to call for everyone to reduce water consumption this summer. Today, she's expected to announce orders regarding that. Governor Spencer Cox also declared a state of emergency for drought this year, and recent storms haven't even made a dent in Utah's water shortage.